Hello everybody, welcome back. How's it here bringing another video? And today, I'm bringing some more Black Ops 3 content. What we're going to be talking about today is the Shiva. Alright, so a lot of people use this gun trying to get dark matter or whatever. Whatever the reason is, they're trying to use it. Maybe because some professionals like to use it. But um, people use this gun and they don't really give it a good enough uh, shot. So they play with this gun for about three matches maximum. And then they're like, this gun's kind of crap. I don't think I like it. Well... What I'm going to try to tell you guys today is how you need to use the gun to get the most out of it. And uh, as you can see, I have dark matter, so I don't. I'm not going to be going over how to get headshots with it today, but I am at the same time. If because one of the uh, attachments that you use really helps with the headshots. So let's get into it. So first off, what I'm using on the Shiva on this game on this gameplay is the rapid fire, um, high caliber, and I. Th think it's rapid fire. Wait. High caliber long barrel and rapid fire, my bad. But uh I'm also using the care package hellstorm and wraps. Those don't really matter. Your kill streaks can always vary and also your specialist can, but I'm using gravity spikes because in those close quarters uh type gunfights, if you do not have like a secondary or anything, the Shiva's kinda crap when it comes to up close and you might have to start hip firing because how slow it is to aim with it. But like I said, let's get started. So the Shiva is made for long or medium to long range gunfights. So you're not going to be rushing with this gun and expect it to be good. Uh, now there is different ways that you can use this gun in close quarters combat to where it actually is good. If you start hip firing and zooming in at the same time like you just seen in the game clip, um, it really does help your aim and you can get some of them kills. Uh, another thing that you can do is put on uh, laser sight because laser sight makes your uh, hip fire like the pattern smaller so it's definitely going to help out when you're in those uh, hip fire uh, situations when they're that close and um, another thing that you can do to actually help is high caliber so uh, high caliber is a attachment that basically makes headshots a one shot kill for the Shiva so any headshot that you get is going to be a one hit kill. That's definitely going to help and on top of that if you start aiming for the heads then I mean one shot kills you can't complain with that at all and uh, also using the Shiva it will actually get your accuracy up so like overall so whenever you're putting on shots you have to land the shots if you don't land the shots then you're not going to get the kill and more than likely you're going to get turned on so uh, it'll, start, it'll start to train you better to get those shots on target, on, on time, and uh, just all around help you as a player. So I think the Shiva's a very good gun for that, uh, or any uh, semi-automatic weapon. So even pistols could work for that, but uh, being a little bit more realistic, the Shiva's probably going to help you. Alright, so I use Rapid Fire because you need to be able to put more shots um, down or at your target as fast as possible especially when your accuracy isn't that good like if you miss one shot out of the three shots you take at them that's more chances that you're gonna die so if you can put four shots down before they can get one shot off more likely you're gonna get the kill so that's why I use the rapid fire um, I use the long barrel because it increases the range and the damage at the range is increased as well so basically from farther distances you can do more damage so that keeps the uh, high caliber attachment at a one shot kill from pretty much anywhere on the map. Um, and it's always a two shot kill no matter where you are. And uh, the Shiva all around, like I said, is think of it more like the Dragonuff Sniper off of like Mono Warfare 2. Where it is almost guaranteed two shot kills unless it's in the head. So it's mainly, it's mainly meant for medium to long range. Uh, like I said, don't rush into combat like you've seen me do a lot here. The only reason why I do that is because I am not someone that likes to camp at all. But if you're someone that likes to sit back, use the Shiva. It's definitely a good gun. Um, if you're someone that likes to rush, I'd probably switch to a submachine gun or a different assault rifle because the Shiva is probably not going to be for you. But uh, also, this gun is very good for getting your KD back up because if you actually are doing good with it, which if you like to camp, you will do consistently. Um, then the Shiva would definitely help you with that. I think I ended up going 42 and 11 in this gameplay, and uh, you know a lot of it was from helps from kill streaks. Another 
was the fact that I was playing kind of laid back. Like, you just see four of my kills in a row. Two of them were for the wraps. But um, those gravity spikes saved me a few times. And, yeah, all around, this was a good gameplay. I'm glad I played. And uh, if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like, subscribe. And as always, this has been Hazard. I'm out. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.